Yes, somebody won a thousand, a thousand, a million dollars. We'll get to that in a moment. But Saturday's jackpot now at eight hundred million dollars with a cash value of three hundred and eighty three million dollars. And as Rhonda mentioned, nobody won the big jackpot there, uh, but there was a match five, which is a one million dollar winning ticket. It was sold here in Michigan at a Shell gas station over in Dearborn. So to see if you are that million dollar winner, which I would hope that they know by now, but the numbers are 19, 36, 37, 46, 56. The Powerball was 24 and the power play was two times. So big congratulations to whoever, whoever won that million dollars <laughs> over there in Dearborn. Very exciting. We're trying to track them down as we speak. Yes, um, I think they might be my long lost cousin. Oh, OK, we'll, we'll find out. You never <laughs> mentioned your family in Dearborn. Uh, yes, well, I'm just going to be meeting them for the first oh, time. I see once they collect their million. <laughs> Uh, listen, there is a, a four legged fugitive on the loose this morning in Detroit. And it's not a dog. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at this. <laughs> a horse managed to gallop away from home and ended up right in the area of Rosa Parks and Tuxedo on Detroit's west side. What? And our cameras caught up with the horse. So you can see there as it tried to to get away from police. Um, it's a beautiful horse. It is, and it's One galloping so One man was so dropping off his nephew at school and helped notify the owner that their horse was on the loose. But where, where does that horse live? Huh. We got out right down the street from here, and I approached the horse because I'm kind of familiar with the horse. I've been to the farm before. The name of the horse is Onyx. You know, and they do a real good thing for the community. So, you know, the horse is friendly, so I approached it. You know, and me and you both. We both kind of, you know, followed the horse. <laughs> Incredible. And who knew about this farm here in the city that does so much for the community? So we're glad that they were able to corral the horse. Uh, the horse was not hurt and neither was anyone else.